Hello, this is the Penguin Man, and welcome to episode number 21 of The Legend of Zelda Tears of the Kingdom. We just finished the Wind Temple, and now I'm going to talk to my guy Tulin about whatever this snail looking thing is. What's happened? Where have we gone? Tulin. My brave fledgling. I know that voice. It's you. You're the one who's been guiding us? Yes. I am your ancestor from a time long ago. I proudly served Hyrule's first king. I was a Rito warrior and a sage with control of the wind. Where you fight, the winds follow. I expect nothing less from my descendant. You make me proud. That monster you defeated, the source of that intense blizzard, it was summoned by the Demon King. He thought it could stop you from obtaining the stone you just found. My secret stone. Demon King? Secret stone? This is a lot to learn all of a sudden. I know. But listen while I tell you what happened in the past. A tale of the imprisoning war. And the mission our people must accomplish. Years ago, when the kingdom of Hyrule was still young, Great evil, the Demon King, descended on the land. He sought to wipe out anyone who opposed him. But Raru, the first king of Hyrule, requested my aid, as well as that of five other warriors, to help in the fight. Raru entrusted us with amazing artifacts, secret stones, Objects that amplified our formidable abilities. I carried one into battle as the Sage of Wind. It was thrilling to fight alongside my fellow sages. Yet we were still no match for the Demon King's overwhelming power. His magic was staggering, and I was unable to slip past his defenses no matter how hard I tried. In the end, King Raru realized that we would not be able to defeat the Demon King. To save our world, King Raru sacrificed himself and sealed the Demon King away. So that was the imprisoning war. The rest of us survived that climactic battle. And I would soon receive a visitor with a request that would define the future of the Rito. It was another of the six sages, the Sage of Time. The Demon King will return. The magic binding him will be undone. When that time comes, a noble swordsman named Link will oppose him. But Link will only succeed with Rito's help. Summon the winds and support this hero. It was clear what part the Rito would play. It will be an honor to defeat the Demon King. I swear to you that when the Demon King returns, the Rito Sage of Wind will awaken once more. And you can count on the full support of the Rito. And now you know about the Imprisoning War and a mission I accepted on our behalf. You've saved Rito Village, but there's more to do. The Demon King will soon recover his full strength. Tulin, my brave fledgling, 
You must take up my secret stone and honor the Sage of Time's request. Fight the Demon King with the Swordsman Link. All right then. So it's my mission to fight the Demon King with you? gave me such an important mission, and it involves fighting alongside you to save the world! If we don't do anything, then the world is gonna be in big trouble. I can't let that happen. I'll do this! I'll happily take this secret stone! And I've got a ring. Well, hello there, <laughs> ghost of Tulin. You can use that ring to call on my power anytime, alright? Okay, let's head back to the village and tell Dad. Well, alright then. Just riding back to the village. Guess we'll see, right? What everything that's that's um just because the the blizzard's gone, isn't it? So that's good, right? Let's go back to the village then. See Teva and the heart in the village. Down. <laughs> Sarcastic laugh. Right. Are we back yet? Oh. You guys, you did it. <laughs> yeah, it turns out it was easy once we started working together. Mm. This is no small feat. <sighs> I still can't believe that the storm went dark from the children's song was real. <laughs> me neither. You could have knocked me over with a feather. Hmm. 
Hmm. Four job well done, Tulin. Huh. Wait, what? This spell meant so much to you, and now you're giving it to me? Hmm. It was always my intention to give it to you once you came as of age as a warrior. Fun fact, that was Ravali's bow from Breath of, Breath of the Wild. Dad! Thank you. I'll prove to you, I've, when I've become a warrior, I can't read that fast. Hmm. Hey Link, that woman in my vision, the ancestor showed us, sh sh didn't she look just like Princess Zelda to you? Huh. Do you think that that was the real princess? I mean, it seemed like a long, long time ago. Hmm. Still a bunch of unanswered questions. Uh -huh. I gotta know more about the figure who saw the storm in dark. So I'm going to go look into more of it personally. Next time you see me, I'll have more information about Princess Zelda. So check in with me sometime, okay? Hmm. Remember, with my sage's power, Two of us can keep working together, no matter what. The Vow of Tulin, Sage of Wind. Proof of the Vow of Tulin, Tulin, Sage of Wind. Use it to summon or dismiss the Avatar of Tulin. Well, that's good. Tulin of the Rito Village complete. Fun fact, guys. Learn this. Where is it? See those two feathers? That black and white one represents his dad, and the purple one re represents his mom. And that, that blue, um, thing represents Rivali from Breath of the Wild. Cool facts, am I right? Right, um, oh, Impa's here. Uh, I should probably talk to her. Uh, let's do it. <laughs> Ah, uh, Link, we meet again. Kado and I came here to see a geoglyph. Sadly, we were thwarted by the blizzard that grounded nearby. After it finally calmed down, we made our way to this village. We plan to get on finding that geoglyph shortly. Oh. The, the ancient literature indicates that the Forgotten Temple is in he here in Hebra, at the bottom of the canyon. We believe that temple holds the key key to unlocking the mystery of the geoglyphs. Mm. But even if we find the temple, our work may, will not be done. There may be geoglyphs located all over the world. We must brace for a long, arduous search. Well, let's head there then. Let's... We still have got... We've just got some time in the episode still. It's like, right the end here. First, what I'm gonna do... So I'm gonna fly up to the Wind Temple and then skydive down to that Hebra Tower, the other Hebra Tower. Then run along, get the, um, what's it called? The, um, uh, the Forgotten Temple, of course. Let's see what's going on there. Maybe do a geoglyph? Oh, what's going on? The ring is ringing. Oh, Tulin's beard. Tulin's vow is granted, granted the power to summon his avatar. Well, that's good, isn't it? Um, which way am I going? This way, probably. Because that's where the marker is, right? So, this guy to, oh, probably not. This way, this way, this way, yeah, 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 this way. There it is. Yeah, tip for Tulin's thing that I learned is um, if you like let go of the paraglider, you go like way faster. Right, let's see what the deal is with this one. With this tower. Can we skydive to the top of it? Oh, it's, it's closed. The 
the Paquita Stone Grove Skyview Tower. Why is it like that? Okay, why is it facing this way, not that way? That's really weird. Right, what's the deal here? Is it just a normal Skyview Tower? Alright then. Get part of the map filled in. See one of these beautiful cutscenes as we fly into the sky. Right. So you can see forever up here, can't you? Um. See, there's also another one. Another uh, geoglyph right there. And. I don't know if that's the next one or not. I'm, like, I want to do them in order, so. I'm gonna see if that's the next one. Because I gotta head to that. What's it called? The Forgotten Temple first. Surface map updated. Sky map updated. Alright, that's good. Hmm. Alright, let's head that way then. How is there how is there something to attack me? Oh my gosh. Is there one of those like Aracuda things? Come on man, I'm going to do this right now. Is that a shrine? No. Wait, that's a stable though. Oh and that's a shrine. Oh, well I'm alright. Well, that wasn't a shrine, but it ended up working in my favor. So let's... Jump down here. Go mark the shrine. Then we can do that shrine speedrun thing. Episode that I was talking about, which... There's a bunch of shrines in that I can now do. Right. Here we are. The Orochium Shrine. Let's head up the stable as well. Snowfield Stable. Right. I'll come back here in a bit. Is that, is that a horse? Man, I could do with a horse right now, actually. <laughs> Trying to get through all these things. Right. Oh no, now it's really slow, isn't it? Oh, uh, come on. Yeah, there we go. Horsey, don't run away, horsey. Oh, don't, don't jump. Don't run off the edge, mate. Okay, good. I thought he just ran off the edge. Oh. That's also a shrine right there. Mark that thing. Let's see what Impa has to say about this thing. Forgotten Temple. Alright, and he's just magically appeared in here. I'm assuming it's in the back, right? I've been here before. I'm not dealing with those either. Send link, you can do that. And there we go. Can you ascend now? There you go. Oh, oh my gosh, I hate when you do that. Hate it. Second time, Link. So. What I'm gonna end up doing is ending the episode right now. So, thank you all for watching, but I'll see you all later. Bye!